On Friday, June 16th, Maine joined the growing number of states requiring law enforcement officers to carry Narcan at all times while on duty when Governor Janet Mills signed LD-1036 into law. But according to Maine State Police Public Information Officer Shannon Moss, most police departments throughout the state have already been carrying Narcan as a precaution. I won't say we were one of the last to start carrying it, but we certainly weren't weren't the first uh, in the city of Augusta. But, you know, what I found as time went on is we were a lot of times the first folks there. And we want all of those things at the immediate disposal for the public and our own officers uh, when it happens. Despite the growing trend of officers carrying Narcan, Representative Nina Milliken of Blue Hill didn't want to leave the decision to individual departments or officers. Currently in statute, it's up to the chiefs or the, the leaders of those departments to determine whether or not their officers should be carrying Narcan. And I didn't want that type of flexibility. I wanted it in law that they had to be carrying it. Obviously, if you had turnover and a new chief came on who didn't think that it was an important thing to do, they might not do it. And I, I didn't like that idea. LD 1036 is the first bill Milliken has ever proposed, and she says as somebody who has suffered from substance abuse disorder in the past, it's incredibly exciting to see it become a law. Well, it feels really personally important, and, and I think it's a good bill for the whole state, so obviously or I wouldn't have put it in. The new law will take full effect on January 1st, 2024. Devin Dagnall, ABC7 and Fox 22 News.